Good morning, guys, and welcome back to Raccoonin. I'm always going to over exaggerate the name because someone said so. At night, there is no comfortable position to sleep. Damn it. Why can't there be a perfect, full, comfortable level to sleep? But welcome to Raccoonin. We last left off. We were exploring this lovely village with these tiny not cat things. In morning, all of them are comfortable. Oh, pretty much. I agree with you, sir. And yes, I am recording this while doing a stream. So if you hear me talking about random shit, it's probably because someone off to the comments said something. I think next time I record this, I'll actually probably put the comments up on the screen just to the, this side. But the, oh, there you go. Like right about here. I'll probably pop up some comments. Maybe next time. It'll be next time. Hi, YouTube. Yuma. Hey kid, wait up. Yuma! I hope you know. Those caves you're about to go into are a tad confusing. If you're not careful, you can end up getting lost. There, I found my Batman voice. Cool. You better take this. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this! Why, thanks, old man. That's really, really nice. I can always count on you for a friendly advice. Though I've never seen a sword quite the shape or size. Oh, God, that's not a sword. That's your indecide. Yes, I can lie. I have painted my swing. Now grab your destiny if you know what I mean. Oh. Hey, <laughs> nice. Twenty-five fifty-seven ten. What is up, man? How you doing? Hopefully, I did that right. Twenty-five fifty. Twenty-five fifty-seven ten. Maybe. Cave okay, bud. I read that wrong. Oi! Are you going in there? That place is weird. Okay. Two fifty-five. What is up, brother? Wait! What are you two doing in here? I'm sorry. Is this area off limits? We were just looking for Morzi. Mor. Morzi. God damn it. Did we get the wrong cave? No. This is. Morizora's cave? But you know. It isn't safe right now, don't you? The envoy are here. Envoy? Envoy? The envoy? You know, spirits that are between this realm and the other. Are we in purgatory? Something like that? Not really purgatory? Yeah, kind of like purgatory. Uh, the music kind of had a haunting tone to it. Right there, just now, there's a haunting tone. I'm listening for it. Most of them are harmless. They're just hanging around or passing through. Trying to survive the work lo workload college brings. Good luck, brother. Good luck. Glad I don't go to college. I don't much need to go to college either. I've been planning on to it. I need to. But I haven't. Hey, congrats going to college. Woo! What you going in for, man, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, but lately, many of them becoming corrupted by bad energy. They're going to be, they're being pulled down to hell! They're so blinded by things like fear and hatred that they aren't themselves anymore. I was in here collecting supplies last week, and a bunch of them stole my tools. Hmm... Hmm. I haven't been able to work at all since then. So we first must find the blacksmiths. I'm so sorry to hear that. Eh, at least I made it out alive. What if... What if we're real... What if we're just really careful? Are you crazy? 
Engineering, the worst of all workloads. <laughs> oh, dude, good luck to you, brother. Oh, I got a friend who went into college for engineering, but I can't remember specifically which field it was. I think it had to, it had to do with rocks. She works for uh, the paving crew up in Alaska, so and she was an engineer grad from up in Alaska. Some sort of geo something, I think. I'm not sure exactly. Don't ask me what. <laughs> Are you crazy? Didn't you hear what I just said? Yeah, but I really need to go talk to Morizora. Plus, we're a lot bigger than you are. Oh my gosh. You just now realize this? Oh my gosh! I was so caught up in my thoughts, I didn't even realize you were like 10 feet tall. Okay, this dude isn't an engineer. We're not 10 feet tall. Close enough. Engineer. What the heck are you anyways? We're humans. I'm pretty sure if I chose brave warriors, he would have said we're brave warriors, wouldn't he? Interesting. <laughs> Psst. You'll, <laughs> you'll be a YouTuber at 21. <laughs> what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, 255, here on a break from Engineering College course. Class is right now. I got about 20 minutes to talk to you guys about this sweet, awesome video game. We'll Let's get right down. We got about enough time for one round of Fortnite. There you go. You got your YouTube career right there. Locked down. It'd be better if you did Rocket League, but, you know. <laughs> Ten. Leebly. Leebly. I've been saying that one. Boom! Done! Okay. Well, best of luck to you. One problem, though. I know you're trying to reach Morizora, but as you can see, the entrance to his grove has been blocked off by overgrown bamboo. I can cut that down if you get my tools back. The spirits put him in that box over there. Everything I need to everything I need to do my job is in that box. Including my axe. So I hope you know you're not you're kinda axing a lot of us. You want me to go do this and that. I gotta swim. He's got a paper hat man, he can't go in the water. We'll do whatever it takes to help you out. You can start by draining this lake. There are two switches in this cave. The control that flow the water. Find them both, and we're good to go. Pretty straightforward, right? I guess. That's the spirit. Er, no pun intended. <laughs> yes, pun always intended. Always. I'll wait here for you to return. Good luck. Two smidges. Sir, um, you look like a poop. Poop? Um, excuse me, do you mind moving so we can get through here? Root suit. I'm sorry, I'm just too tired to move. so tired. Well, usually I love swimming through the dirt. <laughs> so I go on random errands for the tree I belong to. But my tree is main Auschwitz, which means I'm two. So unfortunately I can't move right now. Darth X oh my. That's all right, Darth X oh my. What's up? What's crack lacking? Now give me that good. <laughs> good morning, YouTube. Ah, oh, I changed it for YouTube. Ah. 
Uh, so unfortunately I cannot move right now. Maybe if my tree gets what it needs, I'll be able to move again. But until then, I'm too tired. Okay. We cannot go that way. Oh, I thought that... Okay, I guess we're going... To the right, to the right, to the right! Oh, I want him as a plushie! I must have purple trash. Leather goey golem. Uh, what's the matter? I'm so hungry. So hungry that I can't move. Poor thing. I'm sure we have some extra food that we can give you. No. I can't eat horse food. Horse food? Horse food? Yeah, that's what I just questioned, Mom. I need Stella apples from Stella Cave Tree. Uh. Sign. Eastern water flow switch. Entrance above. Hmm. If only the purple creature wasn't blocking the entrance. Golden child. If Big Brother forgets to eat, he gets so tired that he just sits around and waiting for someone else to feed him. That's not a very good survival strategy tactic for, you know, survival the fittest, which I'm guessing, unless you guys don't really live out in the woods and, mon like, animals and stuff, then that's fine. But if you did, you'd be dead, sir. And you'd be on your own. Enough said. Ah. Uh. Okay, why are we in the tree room when there was an- Oh, because the guy needs apples. Apples. Oh, a little sapling. Still a cave sap. Do you think I'm beautiful? I hear that if you have happy feet, you become more beautiful. Isn't that true? Happy feet, happy feet. Oh, no, that's... that's I was thinking of uh, the river dance and stuff as soon as I heard happy feet. And also the movie Happy Feet with the Penguins. Happy feet! Robin Williams, you will be missed. Hmm, I don't think I heard that saying before. Oh, it must be a tree thing then. I think you have very beautiful green leaves. Thank you! You see, I have three feet. They're probably popping up around here somewhere. But they're so sad right now. How can I be beautiful if my feet are so sad? One is hungry for dirt. One is thirsty for water. And one needs some, some sunlight. Can you please help them? Dirt, water, and sunlight. Okay. Okay, down. Down, down. Um, I haven't seen anything to indicate how to complete this. <laughs> oh. Damn it! Go right. I went left. I'll go right then. Chat says I need to go to the r r r r r right. Oh, that answers my question. Oh. Okay. Be see before you say anything. What those look like? Those. You ever seen Yu Yu Hakusho? Looks like Pooh or Pooh! His little spiritual animal blue thing before it becomes a big phoenix looking dragon thing. That's Tiny Pooh from the tournament of Yu Yu Hakusho. That's what those look like. Hello, little one. Mini Mori. Ah, Mini Mori. Ah, yes. Now that makes more sense. Yes. I am so tired. 
Nah, you're gonna wanna write down the number potion so that you can do the puzzle in yeah, sequential order. I had a long day. Oh. Okay. One, two, three. Excuse me as I write some boxes down. All right, let's do this. Four. One. Oh no, that's two. Two. Yep, every day is someone's birthday. Light the way! Hello! There's number one. Do you think I can fly? Um, depending on which universe you come from, yeah. When will Mori Zoro wake up? Okay, I'm not... I can't do that in chat! Ah, uh, they got little emotes with lights up. It's adorable. The only reason I noticed that this last part is from Legend of Zelda, the Zora. Morizora. Morizora. What number was that? Three? Oh, what did it say? I don't know. Okay. Today is my birthday. That is nice, number seven. Uh, Umbrella Academy. These are children that only go by their names. We don't actually have only go by their numbers. We don't have names for them. I like the Umbrella Academy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Cool. I want to check up here though. Nothing. Okay. Cool. Is that a click? Click and check. Click and check. Click. 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 Check. All right, let's see here. <laughs> More lits. One, two. Stone key. Hmm. That goes down to the that goes down to the lower levels. I wanna get all the upper levels done first. Or what I can get done up here. Hey, I found the blue stone key. What does this foot need? Friendly foot. Hi. Do you have any water? Hmm, let me check real quick. Why, yes. We do have extra bottles of water here. Would you like one? Oh, thanks, kind of you. But when I say water, I mean lots of water. Like, a pond's worth. I drink a lot. Hmm, I don't think we can carry that much water. I understand. If you happen to come across anything, though, we'll let you know. The mom's as much on this adventure as the kid is. That's awesome. It's loose! Pull the lever, crunk. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I can't push again? Dang it, that would have been funny. Hey, this is actually quite a peaceful room. I like it. This is great! I can feel the water flowing up through the ground and into my toes. 
Do you guys do this? All we did was pull a switch. You gave me water! Water! I can finally be me again. Thank you so much. Oh, he's a happy, he's a happy foot. Happy foot, happy foot. He's a foot, he's a happy foot, happy foot. You already helped one of my feet. Thank you. There are two more that need some what something now. Okay. Oh god, I thought that was one of the feet on fire. I'm like, oh, what happened? Why are the feet on fire? No, it's just a regular bonfire. <laughs> Never mind. All right, we're gonna go down, down, down to the down below. Lower levels is where we got to go. Cause they're down, down, down. Oh, Sue! Why does Sue look like an actual person and not a... Lele? <laughs> Have you ever lost something that was really important to you? I was supposed to meet my friend, but I can't remember where we're going to meet. I have to find her before it's too late. I have to. I had to. I had this really catchy song stuck in my head. It's by this budding indie rap artist named Little Buzz. Buds. He's a sky bud. So he looks like me, but he lives in the sky. It's so good. What's the song about? Oh, it's so deep. It's about having to work every day, serving tea to rich buds. Having a high, strong boss who wears powder white wig, making me want to, wanting to make it as a hip hop artist. Hello, real life. What can I do for you today? It really speaks to me. Oh, it's so good. What are you? Oh, I'm a cave butt. Not quite full of grown yet, but I'm getting there. It's so... See ya. Glow shroom. I'm a glow shroom. I'm supposed to glow big and bright. But lately I've been having terrible holding my charges. I need a power outlet? Need a battery? <laughs> Alrighty, make sure to... It's probably all the stress from work. I'm just going to take it easy, make sure to exercise. You know how it is. Yep. Mom? What are those? Hmm. I'm not sure, dear. I wonder if they're the... And Envoy, the Jackie, that Jackie was talking about. Mom? Stay close to me, dear. It's alright, dear. I think they're gone for now. Okay, this right here looks like a face. You got the two eyes and just the straight line mouth. Or is it just me? The eyes. Meowth? No? Maybe? Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. Actually, hold on. Hello, dear. Let's drain the lake so we can give the blacksmith tools back to him. In order to do that, we'll need to find two switch. Okay. Mom? There's so many of them. I'm kind of scared. It's okay, sweetie. Hold my hand and stay close to me. I'll lead us through here.
Just a little bit further. You can do it, sweetie. I'm not controlling this. Mom, we made it! I knew you could do it. Hmm. The dark makes me sad. Friendly foot. Ah, oh, sorry. Tenji, sweet, we're rolling in money. Shiny mage? I don't know what the foot is talking about. The dark is great. I don't like the dark one bit. Neither do I. Mom says there's nothing to be afraid of, but of be afraid of, but I still don't like it. Finally, someone who understands me. These mushrooms don't get it at all. They're like sunlight. Who needs that? Only crazy feet like sun. Well, call me crazy, but I do like the sun. Unfortunately, I took a wrong turn and wound up in a very darkest part of this cave. Can you help me get some sun? Yeah, break the floor! Hey, kid, you wanna come listen to this? I was gonna give him like a heavy metal noise voice because of that, but. If you wanna listen to our guild practice. Guild practice? Oh, you haven't heard of us? We met here every week to jam. We call ourselves. No hold bar! Wah! With exactly three exclamation points at the end! Heck yeah! Get it? Cause we don't hold back. We don't follow the rules. We spell it B A R D, not B A R R E D. Craig? Craigie? Craigie? Because we're literally bards! Ah, no hold bars, huh? It's a play on words. Ah. That's very, that's clever. Lady, I like your style! Hmm. So like, down here, we can be ourselves. Hey, Crazy, for example. Yo. Out in the real world, he's gotta wear a suit and tie and work for the man. But down here, he straight on the electric glue. And then there's little buds. What's up, homies? <laughs> he spends his day serving tea to a bunch of snooty buds in the sky. I'm all like, more sugar, please? Oh, sir? Can I offer you a scone? Only suck ass eat scones. Oh! Whoa there, buds! Sorry! I keep changing their voice. Sorry, I just want to give them an auto, kind of like a slightly auto-tuned voice. Sorry. Sometimes I just gotta let it out! We all do, little buds! We all do. Channel into the music! I hear you, flower! So like I was saying, down here, we can be ourselves and just jam out! So if you need space to just chill out, feel free to kick it with us! No hold pods! Okay. Can I take your fire? What's up, homies? Hey, yo! Okay. Oh. Do I need to step it one more time? Two stomps this time! Bomp, bomp. No stomps this time! I'm so happy! Ugh, 
How can he stand this light? My weakness! Oh! You're killing the shrooms. Light makes me grow! Doesn't it make you grow? No, of course not. It's... If not light, then what do you eat? Dead plants, of course. Mmm. Ah! <laughs> Are you the ones who punched those holes in the ceiling? Did you bring me the sunlight? I'm not sure, maybe. Might have been an accident, though. The best accident ever! I'm the happiest foot in the forest! Hmm. Okay, that's one to foot to down. We got stairs. That leads to those stairs. Okay. Must go down, back down, back down. Oh, they're gone. But there's still creepy thump thump music. Hey! So looks like we need to go back to the stair room. And head him up, head him up. In the face. It sees all! It sees into your soul. It knows your secrets. Oh yeah, we can't go that way because of bamboo. had a best friend. My best friend and I would go everywhere together. We had the best adventures. Both of us were kind of poor. It was sad because sometimes she didn't even have any food. But I always shared my lunch with her because that's what best friends do. Cool. Okay, we need to find a way to drain that water some more. But it seems that we are done where we are at, so I gotta find somewhere else to go. And this YouTube video is gonna be a little bit longer than the other ones because I think I'm gonna end it as soon as we're done with the drainage of the water and getting the blacksmith his stuff. And after that, Mr. Hungry. some of the water yet? No. Okay, bud. Hey, I've never seen you before. You don't look like Leeblees, and you certainly don't look like you're from the Envoy, so you must be new. Do you have any questions? Do you live here? Yeah! I actually live right through that door up there. Unfortunately, some golems were roughhousing right above my front door. Now there's a pile of rocks blocking my entrance. That's terrible. That's no biggie. There's a pig living around here somewhere. He only eats mushrooms and rocks. I'm sure he'll clean this out once he comes around. Do you have any questions? The envoy? The envoy are between this realm and the other. Most of them are harmless. Just spirits passing through. But some of them have grown overcome with bad energy, fear, anger, and the dark side of the force. Give in to your anger. Give in to your hatred and fear. Dude. It's those that you have to watch out for. Do you have any questions? What are you? I'm a cave bud. Along with the mushrooms, flowers, and mini sewers. Mini su Mini. Mi ah! <laughs> we help keep the forest running. Do you have any questions? Never mind. Tulip! The golems are always roughhousing. It's a major problem down here. They caused the rock slides the other day. The only good thing about them is that they smell like grapes. That sounds great. Oh, Mom, look! It's a little onion! Badhead. 
Who are you calling? A little onion. Oh, I'm sorry. You're much bigger than the other onion I've seen. Your face is gonna be an onion if you don't stay out of my way! You have no arms. Oh, look! It's the kid who thinks I'm little! Well, let me ask you something, kid. See these fists? Are these little? The onions are my favorite! What is... What the heck in the French toast? TwitchCon 2017? Uh... Groomaya? Groomaya? Groomaya. Groomaya. Hope I said that right. Don't hurt me if I did. <laughs> I'm terrible with names. Just ask anyone else here. Um, well... You think my fists are little? Well... Uh, what kind of fists do you have? Dumb, stupid fists! Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Screw me uh okay champ. Okay. <laughs> well at least I'm learning a lot today. Oh woe is me. Hunger consumes me, my stomach is empty, it aches. How I long for the nectar of the force, the life-giving ambrosia. That which pleases my stomach, delicious, delectable, divine dirt. You're surrounded by dirt, sir. What's up, little dude? Watch your step, friend. Oh! Hi, Mom. The door is locked. The dog's being weird. No! No! Oh, I almost found it. Ooh. Can we get in from the other side? The door is locked. Yeah, make a big bag boom bag big big zoom 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 about it. Why don't you? No! I want to find every hole before I find the right path. I'm determined there's going to be nothing in it. It's going to be pointless. Hey! Did you know there's a treasure in the room below me? Pity. Behind that locked door. I wonder what's inside. There it is! Redstone key. <laughs> that, 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 okay. Did this have a way up? Yes, it did. What the? Okay, those are interesting looking. Okay, I see another face. Right here. Got the two eyes and the mouth. Oh. Okay. Oh, I messed that up already. Mom, when she jumps on it, doesn't get rid of it. Nailed it. Those rocks are weird. Why are they weird? Well, 
One time I saw a mushroom jump from rock to rock to get the other side, and as he jumped, those rocks turned blue. What's up with those weird, right? Yep. Totally weird. Couldn't figure it out one way or another. Look at another chest. You found pig repellent. Why do I need pig repellent? Hmm. I wonder. I wonder who's in this cave. I wonder who in this cave would want something like pig repellent. Probably someone who has is getting eaten alive by pigs. Can I parkour my way down? Tenji. Parkour? Parkour. Parkour? No. Can't. Okay. Get out of the way, mouse, Bob the mouse. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Oh! Oh, that's right. I went down. Okay. I went this way to begin with. Let's go this way. Hold on. Wait. I just wanted to check something. I want to see if that was like a hidden door. I swear, if you meow. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> the bigger golems are always roughhousing. I'm not ready for that yet, so I'm just hanging out with the cat. Or truffles? Uh, no! Then I'd stay here! <laughs> no, I know where there are some rocks. Follow me. I can show you where the rocks are. Party like a rock. Party like a rock. Party like a rock star. Party like a rock star. <laughs> Okay, I didn't go this way yet. Dude! Ah! Whoa! Ah! What are you doing, man? You totally stepped on the rat room! Rat room? Oh no! I'm sorry. I really didn't mean to. Hmm. Come here, little dude! Am I in trouble? No, we're cool. I can tell you're a good little dude. I'm King Spore. These are my totally radical shim. Shim. Fuck off. <laughs> Together we make up the Rad Shroom Prevention Society, or RPS for short, dude. All around, Morozoa's cave, there's a great battle going on. A war between good and evil, dude. A struggle between rad and bad. This place is littered war zone. Yes, yes. You should be surprised. Shocked, even, dude. Surprised. For ages, the restrooms and the bathrooms have been at war. Restrooms like the poor little dude you just stepped on. Sorry. They fill the air with righteous spores that make you peaceful, kind of full of red. Gotta go do the walk. Go walky walky. Ratroom spores in the airs means we all get along better. Bathrooms, on the other hand. No! Bathrooms are totally uncool. When you breathe in their spores, you become rude. Shrewd, rude, crude, dude. Gnarly. Stock up! So little dude, while it's your totally righteous journey, the RSP asks that you help stomp out bad shrooms. Goodbye. While totally protecting the red. I'll try my I'll try my best. Awesome! 
<coughs> hey, little dude, is that like your mom? Yes. Moms are like totally cool. Hmm. Okay. Step on bathrooms. What are you doing, little guy? Let's view the water from here. Okay. I'm going to accept that. That's okay. What are you doing, little dude? Meep! Meep! Okay, where are we at? Oh, stairs. Mm, yes. We need more axes. I know this is hard to believe, but did you know there is a pig living inside this cave? It's like kind of insane. Lucky for us, they only eat rocks and truffles, not cave bugs. Just between you and me, not that I ever wish being eaten by a pig on anyone, but a pig had to eat someone in this cave. I had to choose who it was. Well, I'll just be honest with you. I'll choose the truffalos. Truffles. Well, they already... That was a rat shroom, wasn't it? Sorry, rat shrooms. All shrooms must die under my heel. The fine porcelain cup is filled with muddy water. That defiled pig that lives down here only eats two things! Rocks and us! Ah, uh, So barbaric! We have the most delicious dirt in all of the forest! And that's how it should be! We are the best mushrooms! We should get the best dirt! HA! Huh? If you come here to ask for our dirt, we're not going to give it to you if you don't give us something in return! What? Wait. Is that pig repellent you're carrying? Ugh, we need that! We'll give you a bag of our best dirt if you give us that pig repellent. I'll even throw in some truffalo perfume! It's so refined. This perfume would make even the lonely gay bud smell like us. Ha ha ha! But stay away from pigs while you're wearing it. Otherwise, they might follow you around. Disgusting. Barbaric! Unsooth! Yes. For some days during perfume. Delicious! Now our unsooth pig will finally give us a peace and quiet. Yep. All of these sandwiches are filled with dirt. These guys are somewhat dirty. Oh, that's convenient. Right, where was our little tree guy? Was he down here? No, he was up one. I think. Yes? Bye, let's do it the easy way. Fuck you, game. <laughs> Just casually walking by, minding my own business. <sighs> Through the dirt wall we go. Ah! Go away, bathroom. Douth! My routine knows to save me? That the divine fragrance may it be thou carriest the tastiest and most covered dirt in all the forest. Give thy family foot their tasty dirt, yes. Oh wonder, oh wonder, I thank thee for thine gift. Fare thee well, my friends. I thank thee for thine gift. Okay. Goodbye, bad shrooms. Whoa, something feels different. It's 
suddenly feels like... Happy. Thanks for clearing the air in here. No problem. Clear the air. So those bad shrooms are actually bad. Well, I guess it depends on... I guess it depends on what you go after. Like, sometimes the sun is bad for some things, it's better than others. The cats are never stopping! Alright, we're almost there, guys. I wonder if this would follow us if we use this. I mean, I, oh, I should probably save it. follow you. Okay. Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. This is a goofy looking pig by the way. Oh, okay. Rocks! Yum travel for dessert! Yeah, good luck finding one of those without pig repellent. Travel room has faded. Th thank you. Now I can finally get into my home. Too bad for truffles, though. Do you have any questions? No. Don't judge my pig, friend. I ain't judging your pig. I'm saying he can eat a lot. I'm impressed. Oh, wait. I'm not gonna read anything. Pull the lever! Oh, I guess that pig finally ate the rocks below the door. Someone needs to tell those golems to go rough out somewhere else. Pull the lever, crunk! Run the lever! Alright, hold on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I read the sign again? Oh, I thought it would get mad at us like the other sign. Dang it. Alright, I pulled the levers. Oh. Did you open... Oh, maybe not. The mini. The. Hold on. Bluestone key, redstone key. Hmm. Yes, yes, I did. That's what, that's what I thought you meant, but yeah. Someone, someone in the chest asked me if I opened up the chest. Whoa, you really good? This place is weird. Okay. Let's do one last loop. Oh, that's right. I need, oh, I need to go talk to the tree again to get him to eat the apple. Ah, I jumped ahead. This reminds me of the apple that's from Kirby. Hi, YouTube! Kobu. Gen. Chaos. Back at it again! Oh, wow! I am so beautiful! My feet. Tell me, you helped all of them. Because you gave them sun, water, and dirt, I am able to grow into full tree. Yeah. I thought you were required to open that chest to get to the other side. Uh, I think so? I did. I just skipped, I just totally forgot to go to the tree. Thank you for helping! We all feel much better now! Here, to say thank you, I want you to have one of my fruit. You receive apple. Cool! We did it!
Small apple. Yes. Oh boy! I feel so different now. It's like I have so much more! Energy! Ooh -ooh. Well, it's like my brother's completely different golem when he's full. Great job. Yeah, I'm probably the brightest glow shroom in here. We're talking a thousand watts, 90 second intervals, and I can bench like five times my own what? Damn! Hey, what? Yeah, I'm probably like the brightest glow shroom. I also make my own dead plant shake. They help me put on the pounds. Okay, bruh. Bad shrooms. Bad! Do I need to go through the whole cave and squish shrooms? I hope not. You drained the lake. Please bring me my tools, and I'll clear the bamboo for you. Okay. Oh. Heh. <laughs> There's a chest here. I must get this first. Tenji! Making all that money, 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 money! I didn't see any bad rooms either. There is a chest. Now, why should I give you this chest now that I found it? You found blacksmith tools. Oh, I'll probably get tool set, not a specific tool. Okay. No. Nope. There we go. Alrighty, alright, 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 alright. Oh, my wonderful tools! You gave blacksmith tools as well, but thank you so much! No, as promised, I'll clear the clear your path to more Zora's Grove! Can I have that? There you go! Well, I'd better get back to my shop. Thank you for everything! Oh, one more thing! If you visit my shop, I can build you some tools of your own. It's going to take me a little time to get everything up and running again, though. So why don't you come by once you're done talking to Morizora. Morizora. Hopefully I'll be ready by then. Good luck! I think I keep changing everyone's voices, but there's so many different people I can't keep it correct. You know, now would be a great time to end it, but I'm not because I'm curious. Unless there's more. What's up? I recommend against going down this path for the time being. There are far too many envoy beyond this point. I love the buds. Cave buds are my buds. Cave buds are best buds. Yes. Looks like we. Looks like we. Have, looks like we have visitors. Hmm. I do not recognize their kind at all. I don't think they're from Morizora's forest. Hmm. Hmm. Definitely not from around here. Definitely not. It's been many years since we've had visitors such as these. Hmm. Oh. Morizora's Helper, tell me, young boy, what brings you to Keeper's Grove? I want to ask Morizora if he would grant me a wish. I'm willing to do whatever it takes. I'm sorry, but Morizora's been sleeping for a while now. Oh. Do you know when he's going to wake up? My boy, this is an this is not an ordinary slumber. A darkness has fallen over Morizora's land and over him as well. A darkness. 
You see, we have long shared this world with the Envoy. They are spirits between this realm and the next. Typically peaceful, merely passing through. However, ooh, lately, more and more of them have become overrun with negative energy. The dark side of the force. Anger, fear, hatred. The whole forest can feel it. If Morzora sleeps and darkness succumbs his land, we are all in danger. This is terrible! We have to do something! Hmm. Let me try to wake him up for you. Haha, <laughs> my boy, Morzora cannot be woken up by just any means. Actually, this will probably do good with the, my terrible Irish thingy. When the darkness has cursed him to fall, caused him to fall into slumber, the only thing that can awaken him is a very special song. Oh, God, the song right now. A song that we call Mori, Mori no Kokoro. Mori no Kokoro. Can you teach it to me? No, my child, I cannot. But that's not to say that you can't learn it. When you can hear that are too quiet for ears, the fear and loneliness, the hopes and dreams of those around you, then you can awaken him. I'm sorry, but I don't understand. Look around us. Do you see the stones with different markings? Yes. Yes. Each one represents a voice that is calling out for your help right now. A man who connects with his wife has been severed. A woman who prepares to lose that which is most dear to her. Seek them out along with the rest who call out to you. If you help them, they will teach you what you seek to learn. See the one over there? Yes. Listen. My wife's been asleep for months now. <laughs> oh! Something tells me that it's a good place to start. Good luck, young one. Return to us if you need any help. Hey, that's a good spot to end!